so we're, we're training today, so we're going to practice the autopilot uh, disable drill. It should the airplane do something that you didn't command, or that you don't think you commanded, then you have to do the right thing right away, no delay, it's a memory item. To that end, we have a red autopilot disconnect, but in order for this to work correctly, when the autopilot misbehaves, don't think about which axis is misbehaving. Press and hold the red autopilot disconnect. And then find and pull the breaker for the pitch trim. Now in this case, it has a red cap on it. We put that red cap on that, and the reason is so we can find that breaker quickly. You also can't have any charts or anything in front of that breaker. It, uh, it needs to be seen. Okay, so here's the drill. Here we go. Now, to simulate a, a runaway autopilot, I'm going to use control wheel steer. So, I take control of the airplane. You don't like it. Press. Press the button. Press the button. Press it. Hold it. Don't let it go. Now you have control of the airplane. No. Get level. Get level. Yeah, that's it. Go back to your course. Yeah. Yeah, you have control. You're holding that button. You have control. Don't let the button go. You have control. Now, under control, find the breaker. Just touch it today. Don't pull I it. Touch. Okay. Let go. And now we wish to be back on the autopilot because we know it's operating correctly. So turn the autopilot back on. Very good. That's the drill. This is Dick Rochford. Fly safely. Train often.